Hello everyone, Heather here, and I want to talk about my trade in VIAC. So I took this on Friday. I took it right in the middle of the day, actually. <coughs> right in the middle of the day. I entered the 820 VIAC 45 calls at 250, and they were pretty much flat. Why do I like VIAC? Well, look at this nice little run up funny above the 200. This was the, um, was it Arch Archipelago? I forget which hedge fund, something like that. One of the hedge funds, new hedge fund fallout news, right? And it just got, I, I don't know, I felt like this was such an overreaction. Even when it was happening at the time, we we talked about that it just felt you know, way out of whack. But then it couldn't really get out of its own way. All of this volume has continued to build in and accumulate a bunch of it here. And we finally started making our way up the, the um, above the 200. We've been watching this as it's been kind market of update. dancing along the 50 here. And finally made that, that move. So I did enter these. Again, it was the 820 VIAC 45 calls at 250. Now this morning, it's Monday morning. It is Monday, June 28th. I entered this last Friday. Uh, it is taking a little bit more of a move. You can probably, if it holds about where it is now, you'll easily get 10% out of this. I'm going to let this move. Um, you take partial profits out or uh, go ahead and uh, take profits and then come back into it. But I see there's just so much room here against this overreaction. I feel like this is an overreaction. Apparently a lot of people did not. A lot of people ended up dumping it. But I'm going to allow this a little bit of time here to crawl up and get you know, like a 25%, um, maybe a 25% gain on it. Or if it moves well, let's go ahead and hold it, sell a little portion of it out, and then um, continue to let it work. That is my plan for it. It looks very good. Um, you can come back and look. These candles are really tiny, but you can look here on the weekly. We used the 50 and then pushed up and closed above the weekly 200 as well. Nice look there in the weekly. And then when I did enter it, here I entered it as it broke out of the opening range and it pretty much sat there the rest of the day now don't forget we had rebalancing on Friday so some of this extra volume built into the last few candles of a lot of charts uh, looks a little bit out of whack but uh, overall during the day once it broke out of that opening range it held very very nicely and that's what I was watching for Okay, if you have any questions about VIAC, please reach out, Heather C. at GivingTreeTrading.com.